People love portable air conditioners and for good reason. You don't have to lift anything up. Just roll one of these in the room, stick a tube in the window and things get cool. But the reality of these things tends to be different. If you've ever bought a portable air conditioner, they're usually really loud, they're hot and they can barely cool even a tiny room. But fortunately in this video, I'm gonna show you a brand new portable air conditioner called the Drio Twin Cool that will completely change your mind. The first feature on this thing I love is it's a true dual hose design. That means it's got a hose that pulls air out of the house and another hose that pulls air in. Now there's some detailed videos about why this is better, but those two hoses are gonna give you better efficiency, but more importantly, they stop the issue with a single hose design. And that's that that hose is continuously exhausting air out of the room, and that can actually make a vacuum inside your house, pulling in more more hot air from the outside. And finally, this is a portable air conditioner that is super quiet. My room noise levels are around 34 decibels. When I put the Dreo Twin Cool on at full blast, it's only hitting 46 decibels. That makes this the quietest portable air conditioner on the market today. But this thing's got another secret. This isn't just a tiny little air conditioner. This is a 12,000 BTU model. Now let's compare that to the single hose portable hair air conditioner. This one, once I turn it on full, is putting in almost 51 decibels of sound. Now each decibel that you go up is a huge increase in noise, but this is even worse because this hair is only an 8,000 BTU air conditioner. Now compared to the Drail being a 12,000, that is a major factor that that thing can be so quiet while putting out over 30% more cooling. There's also a big difference in how each of these models looks once they're installed. Now the Drail definitely takes up a little bit more window space, but I much prefer how tight it is to the wall. You just set it in front of the window and that hose goes directly into the outlet. When you look at the single hose design, it's pretty much impossible to keep those hoses tight. Now it does have one advantage that you can put it quite a bit of a distance away from your window, but unfortunately there's also a disadvantage. The single hose design gets really hot. When we look at the Drio's dual hose, this thing is completely cool. Another huge difference with this Drio model is it's got massive air output. It was ice cold and it's got that electric louver. That's a handy feature that's gonna do a way better job circulating air around your room. And because most portable air conditioners shoot those hoses out the back, you've gotta take them off when they're not being used and this is what they look like during storage. But this Dreo Twin Cool came up with a better idea. The hose just collapses right into itself. It's even got this clip that secures it when it's not in use. Now they don't have any way that you can store the actual window plate, but this is still so much neater when you're putting it away for the season. And it's also equipped with handles on the sides as well as wheels that'll make getting it around a lot easier. The other dirty secret about portable air conditioners is that many people buy them to use in casement windows or if you've got windows that are just vertical. This thing came up with a better idea. Rather than just kind of butcher the plate, they actually have an adapter. It snaps right into this collar and now it inverts the air output. Now you can install this thing in any kind of vertical window and it's gonna actually look good and you won't end up with any type of hose kinks. The remote control that comes with this portable air conditioner is pretty amazing. It's got a digital display. You can see the room temperature as well as the settings on the device. But they've also got some pretty cool features like a night mode timer, and you can even switch the LEDs off. And that's gonna be awesome if you're in a bedroom so that the lights don't keep you up. Now they do include these foam gaskets. These ones are gonna go on the top and the bottom and they give you some for the side as well. And they also include extra material and you can fit this thing in a window up to 36 inches wide. Security is always a concern with any type of portable air conditioners and they do give you this small bracket that you can screw into your window and they say this will keep it secure, but you have to consider that for your own installation. You might need to do something with a piece of wood or potentially something else. Now personally, if you notice, you can see some light on mine. I didn't use any of those gaskets and that's just how I use these things, I don't want a lot of trouble, so I'm gonna hang on to those gaskets, but personally, I never really bother installing them. Now keep in mind this is a 12,000 BTU air conditioner, so that could cost you a lot of money to run, but fortunately this model is totally different. It's got an inverter inside. That can potentially reduce your electrical use by as much as 40%, because this has the ability to slow down or speed up. Normal compressors like the one that are in your refrigerator, they can't do that. They can only operate at one speed, and that means anytime it's on, it's gonna use a constant amount of electricity. And the biggest surprise of all is this thing sells for just $599. Now while that is a lot of money, compared to this hair that I paid $4.99 for, it's amazing that for $100 more I get an inverter design, dual hoses, way more features, and the thing is super quiet and super powerful. If you're looking for any kind of portable air conditioner, I can't recommend this one more highly enough. It's definitely the one to buy.